up, Sav? Doing media for Three Sweet Productions tonight. What's up, mother? Am I allowed to cuss? What do you buy? Oh. See you right there. Oh my god. You wanna try it? Shit. Oh, my, what the no, shit? I that bag. That's not. Just hold on. It goes oh. up. Down. No way. <laughs> I want one. Kind of make it sound like it's late. Yes? So just say yes. Yes. Have you been looks like that, Lane? Yeah. Well, ladies and gentlemen, no, I got, I got a weak finish. Ladies and gentlemen, this is just an illusion. <laughs> Bob Jin, if you want to see a miracle, let me hear you say yes. Yeah. Yes. If you guys like the show, my name is Dre Magic. If you don't like the show, my name is Manny Pacquiao. Uh, <laughs> so, have fun. Have fun. <laughs> dope though magicians are fucking sick you know dre is dope already like that's don't need to say anything about that masato blew my damn mind so i am masato <laughs> um she wanted me to introduce myself i'm okay. masato all right so <laughs> we're out here at club gin tonight for three suit productions and i got a bottle of soju hanging out of my pocket I'm just gonna put. Oh. This is where you insert um, the Thug Life meme on her, the glasses and the sponsors. Holla. Yeah, uh. right. They're gonna. Sponsor us. Okay. No, seriously. Yeah, right. Sponsor us. Can you tell me what you thought of um, Dream Magic set over here? Since he went before you, you had to follow his amazing ass set. Wow. Uh, to be honest, it was. <laughs> Just for context, Dre Magix is in the back jumping around and shit. <laughs> hey, real talk though, that was that show is that you guys will see the show. Like, we're gonna post it or show clips or something. But to start off a show with that performance, I mean, I was glad I didn't immediately have to follow you. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. How do you feel about your own set? I liked it. I ha uh, haven't had uh, like that good feeling off of a show in a while so this is you're pretty damn great thank you i, appreciate I mean it. i'm amazed every single time that i watch dre but at this point in my life because ever since i've met dre he's preferably the only magician that i watch before so him you're now numb to all of his stuff not numb not numb i just he's my <laughs> preference but now like i have more than one preference um how 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 do you feel i mean how do you feel about that 
being funny, already having the entire audience um, laugh and also be amazed at your bit for your whole set, however you want to call it, and then having a comedian come up right after you. I mean, it's cool. It, like, when whenever I perform, especially, like, in the beginning or middle of a set, unless there's, like, a homie that's performing, I'm kind of just, like, tuned out because mm. it's, like, it's, like, coming off of work. You know what I mean? It's, like... You don't want to go to work and then watch someone work. <laughs> like, <don't laughs> you know what I mean? And But, yo, the set after mine was a comedian, and the one after that was my homie Masato. Yeah. And I got to tell you, don't fucking pan to him. It's not his part yet. And I got to tell you, he killed it. He, he was hitting did. all the lines. Like, some of the stuff we he showed me, and it was just the two of us, and I'm like, this is okay. This is, like, okay magic. And he's been telling me for for months, you're like, this is strong shit. And I'm like, yeah, but it's just like, okay. I believe him now. It's <laughs> strong fucking he shit. He saw that shit. Like, I saw that shit. And, I mean, no, I can't even say anything. The yeah. last trick, okay, Masato's last trick, I volunteered because, you know, I'm that bitch. She's a fucking diva. I'm, I am a diva. That shit blew my fucking mind. I wanted to just cry. I don't, I can't even, Just cry. there are no words for the amazement, the, the state of mind I was in during wrong. Masato's magic bit. Yeah, Masato's a monster. I'm glad he's on my team. Yeah. Because uh, I wouldn't want to fight him. <laughs> <laughs> you know, you crack jokes during your bit. Masato cracks jokes during his bit. Is, do you think that, I guess you can answer after him too. Nah, is, he's done. Is Fuck comedy... Him. Is comedy a really important part of your magic? Yeah, because it makes people not look at my hands. <laughs> but sometimes you tell stories, and it's not just about you being funny, and you tell some real shit. Yeah. Um, here's the thing, and I know Masato feels the same way because we've talked about it. Um, this is your goal as a performer. Okay, whatever you are, whoever you are, you don't want them to book a performer. Mm. I never want them to book just a magician. I want them to book me. And so that's why all the stuff I do is, it's either super funny or it's personal. But the key thing is like, I mean the magic's there, it has to be or else you're garbage, right? But you have to be personable, mm -hmm. personable. Pers personable. Pers person personable. Comedic. No, not, not just comedic, <laughs> but they have to see your personality through it. Right? Because, like, now, you can be, I mean, you can do magic and it's great. I mean, magic's great. Whatever. Mm -hmm. But I don't want them to book a magician. I want them to book Grey Magics. I want them to book Masato. I want them to book Rocky. You know what he I mean? He wants them to book uh, Sav for their uh, photography, and photography. For and their and artists. Because, you know, your girl does poetry and she fucking raps sometimes. She gets one soju in her, and she gets all pummely. <laughs> Whatever. But I'm saying, this is, that's, that's, honestly, that's the real secret to booking. Right? Like, I book, uh, I book a lot of stuff. It's not, like, the most. But all the bookings I have got, and all the people that do buy tickets to the show, it's like, hey, we've met before, and you're cool, and we've had a real conversation. And you just didn't try and sell me, like, you know, was it called snake water whatever it is you didn't ju just try and sell me bullshit holy water right yeah something like that <laughs> dang right? sorry i've been <laughs> into that so much but here's the thing right like if you be nice to people if you're fucking friendly if you can shoot the shit if you don't like be fake and always have to be on then people are gonna want to book you people are gonna want you around because think of it would you rather have a magician that you've never met or like oh i want him to hang out after and just chill with me you know what i mean and that's the secret to my career at least and that's honestly why i have the team i mean we have the team at three suite that we do right i want to hang out with all these people and that's why we pump out fucking 50 videos in two months because it doesn't seem like work we're just work. hanging out Work. It's not work. We're just kicking it. Oh yeah. Look at this. Like I'm here with my friends. I'm getting free food. I'm taking fucking alcohol home, and I do magic for like four people in there. <laughs> what would you like to say to the people right now? 
you made it this long, thanks for watching, <laughs> and I hope you keep watching. Oh, follow, like. like, subscribe, okay? Hopefully there'll actually be, like, links right here. <laughs> Somewhere. Um, hashtag Litimit 2019. <laughs> Litimit. That fool was saying it's Litimit. Litimit. He was like saying Litimit. Lit Remember, he spelt it. He spelt it. It was L-I-T. It. it was L-I-T. Like, Timit. Timit. <laughs> L-I-T. Timit. I'm like, what the heck? And just gonna take a sip. Oh, we're gonna get demonetized. Hold on. <laughs>